Hey everybody, Rob Maurer here with a short little mini episode as we approach battery day. As I said in my battery preview episode, there's one more thing that we did not explicitly discuss in that preview episode that I wanted to make sure to highlight as a standalone episode here ahead of battery day. So you may remember in the preview, we talked about the potential for Tesla to announce advancements in battery energy density, unupdated battery form factor, dry battery electrode technology, cell to pack, the list goes on and on, a million mile battery, things like this. And then in the comments, people have guessed that the one thing that I haven't talked about yet are the potential for battery recycling, red one materials, maybe some possible collaboration with JB Straubel's new organization there, or things like improvements in energy storage, virtual power plants, significant cost reductions, although we did talk about that a bit, the frame casting for the Model Y, expanding that to other vehicles, other improvements in the powertrain, specifically with the drivetrain, all of these things, the list goes on and on for what people have guessed. So as battery day approaches, consider all of these rumors, all of these things that we've heard, all these potential advancements in battery technology and battery manufacturing. This stuff is not happening and would not happen. There is no internal combustion engine day. So the most important thing to remember as we head into battery day is Tesla's pace of innovation. Even if we don't hear all of these things with this battery day update, these things still exist as potential advancements in the future. Battery cells are going to continue to become more energy dense, more energy dense. They're going to continue to become cheaper and cheaper. The disruption is happening. The inflection point is here and the internal combustion engine is dead. And that is the most important thing to know as we head into battery day. So keep that in mind. Make sure you're subscribed here to follow everything live from the event. I'll be tweeting about things too at Tesla podcast and I'll see you soon. Thank you.